aggressive? Well, the American Japanese Society is a, a very established and uh, body with excellent reputation, and it has been helping the Technion for very many years in um, support for extremely important projects, including um, buildings, including laboratories, support for individual faculties, and, and uh, a large number of other projects. When the American Technical Society takes upon itself to support a project, they do that. They, they can get the money needed to support a project. And um, you know there are quite a few societies, uh, technical societies around the world. The American Technical Society is number one in size and, and the size of uh, contributions. Um, I think the second is the Israel Technical Society. And so are, all of them are extremely important. All these societies are extremely important. Uh, you know, although the Technion, you can call it a state university or the parallel of a state university in the United States, but the state of Israel does not provide many of the needed uh, hardware, buildings, laboratories, and so on. And, and the American Technical Society took upon itself to support all these. So they do a great job. On a personal level, I can tell you that they have supported part of my laboratory in the past. And uh, that was uh, extremely helpful. Uh, in fact, the Philadelphia chapter did most of the work. The American Technical Society and, and the Technion are, are very uh, tightly linked. Uh, we know them very well, they know us very well, they know our needs, and they are, their operation is fantastic for the future as it were in the past. Their contributions are extremely important for the future of the Technion. And you know, the Technion is an extremely important university in Israel. Like in, as far as I'm concerned, that's the most important university in Israel because we produce the manpower for the industry in Israel. Other universities also produce engineers and scientists, but we are a dedicated university to engineering and science. And most of the engineers of the country come from the Technion. Most of the leaders of engineering and entrepreneurship and industry in Israel are Technion graduates, bachelors, masters, PhDs, large numbers, huge figures, 70% and more of the industrial, industrial leaders in Israel come from Technion. And so the contribution of the of ATS, or the American Technical Society of Technion, is helping the Technion, but really it's helping the state of Israel because, because we make all these wonderful engineers for all these industries. Now, there's a very popular book that came out. I'm sure you're familiar with it, Startup Nation. Yes. And many people uh, reading that book might not have been aware of all of these wonderful uh, stories in Israel, in the high-tech industry. Yes. And now many people want to be involved on that level and become part of the startup nation themselves, even the people in the United States. Maybe they're not scientists or engineers, but they want to feel like they're part of the story. Mm -hmm. How would you think, what would be the best way for them to be part of the story? Um, what, what is a good pathway for them or a good way for them to be, be able to be part of this good news from Israel? Well, the first thing I would recommend they come to visit and see what's going on uh, in Israel. Come visit Technion, um, receive information for the top officials from the president of Technion, from the provost, and for public relations of Technion. They will provide you with excellent um, information. And then, and then go and see these industries. And through the Technion, you can visit almost any industry in Israel that you want because there is always a technical graduate that we can call and, and he will arrange this visit. So this is number one. And then any contribution to the enhancement of the Technion and therefore the enhancement of, of this uh, high-tech nation uh, will, be, uh, will be the right thing to do. Can you say, can you say that people, um, if they do make a gift to the Technion, 
um, that they may be supporting a future Nobel laureate? Oh, definitely. Uh, here is one example. <laughs> um, yes. The, um, the contributions allow us to provide the essential initial laboratories for new faculty. And it gives them a jump start. Instead of trying to build their own laboratory, but that may take years, the Technion gives them a laboratory. And within a couple of years, they are up high on the, in the scientific community of their, of their uh, profession. So this is extremely important. This is extremely important. And it brings everybody closer uh, to the high-ranking prizes and, of course, to the summit of the Nobel Prize. What I feel about the prize is that it gives me certain powers I did not have before. I have more access to Israeli government officials. We work on joint projects and they are willing to listen. So this access is important, not for me personally, but for science and education in Israel. These are two major, major topics of, of my interest. And, and I, I have been working for that for many years in the past, and I will be continue to work on that. And so, in practical terms, what the prize meant to me is that I have, may have more power to move more projects in education and more projects towards uh, promoting science um, in, in high schools and, and maybe before that. Science is very objective and, and, and we believe that the Nobel Prize is, is very objective and so are many other prizes are very objective. And the fact is in the last six years Israel has four Nobel laureates in chemistry. That's a fact. So there's something good going on there. I hope it will continue this way. And, um, and we have excellent candidates. So, yeah. I think these good news are also, in a way, balancing somehow uh, the, um, the view from abroad on, on Israel. By, by supporting the Technion, you really support education and science in Israel. The, the importance of your contributions and the importance of the support of Eternion is, is very, very high. And, and it goes directly to benefit uh, education, to benefit industry, to benefit entrepreneurship in Israel. And consequently, you are contributing indirectly to the well-being of the whole country through the Technion. This is the right thing to do.